Hello and welcome to SG Speechless. Today's video is going to be another skin combat video and today's skin is going to be Ang. Let's get into this video. This video is going to be another skin combo video and today's going to be Ang and this skin can be obtained by purchasing the premium reward track of the Elements event or basically the Avatar event. It'll cost you 1000 V-Bucks to get the premium and as soon as you buy it you'll get the Ang skin. There is also a second Ang skin right at the end once you get 11,000 Chi which is this one right here which is Avatar State Ang. So once I do eventually get this style or skin, it says style but it's an actual never skin. I'll make sure to get combos done for this one. Let's get into the first combo. So Aang is a part of the Avatar set in Shooting Chat 5 Season 2. Obviously, his description says he may have a lot to learn, but this young Avatar can save the world. It's a very cool skin. I've been using it a lot since I unlocked it. The first back bling is the Fire Starter, part of the Renegade Flame set in Shooting Chat 2 Season 3. Works very nicely for the Fire theme. Obviously, Aang's pretty cool. So he can use a lot of different elements. You can pretty much use anything. He's has a lot of different powers he can use. So this was pretty easy to make combos with, just with the Aang skin in general. You can pretty much do all of it. You can do Fire Bending, Water Bending, Earth Bending, Energy Bending. Pretty much anything works very nicely, but this one works nicely for the fire theme. Pickaxe is a spell work scimitar part of the Doctor Strange set. In Shooting Chat 3 Season 2's Battle Pass, this is Doctor Strange's pickaxe from that season, and I'm using it for the orange design. Probably one of my favourite Marvel series pickaxes I own. The glider for all combos is the Mandala Disc. Part of the Doctor Strange set in Shooting Chat 3 Season 2. It's his glider, but I'm using it for the orange theme. You can use any other glider that's orange theme, would work nicely. Or if you have Avatar related one, you could also use Korra's, but I don't currently have that unlocked. So you can use anything orange theme or just anything elemental theme, like water, fire, ice would work nicely. But I'd decide to use this for the orange. Contrail is Avatar's Descent. Part of the Avatar set in Shooting Chat 5 Season 2. But I'd use this for the Avatar theme, and this is Korra's. Contra from this season works very nicely for the four elements. And the first weapon wrap is this one right here, which is a fiery theme one, which is Skull Fire, part of the Ghost Rider set in Shooting Chap 2 Season 4. Very nice Marvel series weapon wrap, as I mentioned, works very nicely for the fiery theme. Let's move on to combo number two now. For this one, I thought I'd use it will make an avatar themed combo with the backlink and pickaxe. Backlink is from this season, which is the Avatar Cycle, part of the Avatar set in Shooting Chapter 5 Season 2. And this is Korra's backlink, has the four elements, works very nicely with the skin, also goes very nicely with the contra I'm using for the combos. Pickaxe is Zuko's broadsword, part of the Avatar set in Shooting Chapter 5 Season 2. And the Zuko skin can be bought separately or in the bundle. It's quite, I know it's quite expensive for the bundle for himself and also with the actual the Katara skin as well. But I thought I'd use it basically for the pickaxe because it goes very nice. If you can use any of the other Avatar pickaxes as well, would work nicely. And then the weapon wrap I'm using for this combo is this one right here, which is another fire themed one. I guess you could say a magma themed, which is which was introduced in chapter one, season eight, and is iron shot weapon wrap. Using it for the fiery theme and mainly the orange. Let's move on to combo number three now. So this one, probably my favourite one I've been using recently. It's like not really set like a theme wise, but I'm using the back when it's orange. Part of the To the Moon set in Shooting Chapter 2 Season 6. And this is Diamond Hands' back bling. Really like to use this for the orange. Pickaxe is a guiding glow. Part of the Red Riding Hood set in Shooting Chapter 1 Season 6's Battle Pass. I just like this for the design. I really, really do like this pickaxe a lot. Also sounds pretty cool as well. How it sounds. I've been using it a lot since I got the Ang skin. And the weapon wrap for this combo. Is an icon series weapon wrap, which is the Goosebumps, part of the Travis Scott set in Houston Chapter 2 Season 2. Using it for the orange and blue design. Obviously, this hasn't came back since Chapter 2 Season 2, same as the Travis Scott skin. Hopefully, at some point, they do come back in the future. Let's move on to combo number four for the Ang skin now. For this one, I thought I'd use the Fractured World Back Bling, part of the Galaxia set in Houston Chapter 2 Season 4. And Galaxia was the first ever crew back skin we got. So, obviously, if you subscribe, Right at the start, you'd have this back bling. I'm mainly using this back bling because it's got fire, it's got water, it's got earth as well. So basically it basically is earth, so it works very nicely with obviously all the different elements. Pickaxe is the Ahsoka Staff, part of the Ahsoka Tano set. Introduced in Chapter 4, Season 4. I just thought this combo very nicely. Goes very nicely with the white, which is very nice with the staff themes. I know in the actual event pass, you can get like a staff for the Ang skin. Or Ang in general, and obviously he does use he does use a staff in the actual show, so I thought it'd work nicely. It's not brown, but it does work nicely for the staff theme. Let's move on to the weapon wrap now. 
for this one, I thought I'd go for Ripley, which is a Slurp series wrapping up part of the Slurp Squad set. Introducing chapter two season one, try, basically trying to go like a water theme. I know it's a Slurp, but try, go for like the blue, the light blue, and the dark blue as well. Basically using it for water. Let's move on to the next combo. Now, for this one, combo number five, I thought I'd use the Endless Scroll. Part of the Spire's Cool set, introducing chapter two season six, just goes very nicely with the skin. It's also reactive as well. Pickaxe is the Leviathan Axe, part of the Oathbreaker set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 5. And this is Kratos' Pickaxe, definitely one of my favourite gaming legend series I do own, or pickaxe-wise. And Kratos and Leviathan Axe should be coming back pretty soon. I've heard um, I've heard a mixture of different dates. I've heard the 20th of this month and 27th, so he should be coming back very soon. Obviously, when he does come back, I'll make sure to get combos done for Kratos. And I'll also probably get update combos done for Le Leviathan Axe as well. So if you are looking out for him, hopefully he should be coming back in the next couple of weeks. But obviously, we've been waiting quite a while, so you know who knows at this point. Let's move on to the Wrath Raptors combo now, which is this one right here, which is the Starry Sea. Introduced in Chapter 4, Season 3. I'm using it for the for like watery theme and also the orange and yellow as well. Goes very nicely with the color scheme of Ang. Let's move on to the next combo now, which is combo number 6. For this one, I thought I'd do something a little bit different. I thought I'd use a Shield Back Bling. I'm using a Frozen series. Part of the Frozen Legend set, and it's a Frozen Red Shield, introduced in Chapter 1, Season 7, and it's a Frozen Red Knight's back thing. I was either going to use this one, or I was going to use the Frozen Love Wings. Well, it's very nice, obviously. For, I know it's frozen, more ice, but obviously, when ice melts, it turns into water, so I just thought it'd go nice with the blue theme, to be fair. Pickaxe is the Icebreaker, part of the Arctic Command set, introduced in Chapter 1, Season 1. I thought I'd use this just to go with the icy theme, or it's Icebreaker, goes very nicely with the Frozen Red Shield, to be fair, I like to combo those together. And the web wrap I'm using is this one right here, which is my favourite icy theme web wrap I own, which is Indigo Ice. In Shooting Chapter 1, Season 7, use it for the ice theme and also the silver as well. Goes very nicely with the icebreaker and also the frozen red shield. Let's move on to the next combo now, which is this one right here, which is combo number 7. For this one, I thought I'd use a back bling from the actual event pass here, which you get for 2000, which is this one right here. It's for 2000 Chi on the free tier. The Four Elements Banner is the name of the actual back bling. Part of the Avatar set, introduced in Chapter 5 Season 2. This one's pretty cool. It has four different tribes. It has the Water Tribe, Earth Kingdom, Fire Nation, and Air Nomads. For my combo, I'm using the Air Nomads. You can use any of the styles, Fire Nation, Earth Kingdom, or Water Tribe. But I decided to use the Air Nomads for the yellow. Pickaxe is the Soul Fire Chains, part of the Ghost Rider set, introduced in Chapter 2 Season 4. Using this for the Fiery Theme. And the weapon wrap is a blue themed weapon wrap, which is this one right here, which is polished stone. Introducing chapter 3, season 3's battle pass, using it for the light blue and dark blue design to basically have like different colours on, on Ang. So you have the yellow of the back bling for the nomads, and you have the, obviously the orange for the sci-fi chains for the fire, and obviously the weapon wrap is for the water. Let's move on to the next combo now, which is combo number 8. For this one, I thought I'd use a hollow back. Which is part of the Boundless set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 4. And this is one of the customised and superhero skins back bling. And the actual... Is it a sticker? The, the actual emoticon I'm using is this one here, which is from the actual event pass from the Premium. So you need to get a 1,000 Chi to get it in the Premium. And this is how it looks. It is called the... Let's click on it. The Baffled Ang is the name of it. It goes very nice. It's animated as well, which is pretty cool. So I thought I'd use it because basically it is, it is his head or his face, I should say. Pickaxe is the Harley Hitter. Part of the Gotham City set. Introduced in Chapter 2, Season 1. I thought I'd use it for like the actual red and the blue. And just a Harley Hitter goes very nicely in general. So I thought I'd combo it with this... Oh, I thought I'd use it in this combo. Let's move on to the weapon route now, which is this one right here, which is Open Fire. Introduced in Chapter 3, Season 2, using it for all the different colours. Got a little bit of red, got a little bit of yellow as well. After the fiery theme, it goes very nicely with obviously the Ang's outfit he's wearing. He's got a little bit of orange, a little bit of, a little bit of yellow as well. I just like this weapon app a lot. This is how it looks on the actual gun itself. Let's move on to the next combo now, which is combo number 9. For this one, I thought I'd use the Autumn's Mantle, part of the Changing Season set. Introduced in Chapter 2, Season 1. I thought I'd use it for the orange design based on Autumn Leaves. It's pretty cool looking back thing actually. Pickaxe is the Kami Sanin's staff, part of the Dragon Ball set, introduced in Chapter 3, Season 3, using it because obviously it's a staff, and I know in the actual event pass we have this one right here, which is the Air Nomad staff, I would, I would use that if I do have it unlocked, that's why I'm using the Kami, set, the Kami Sanin's staff as an alternative, works very nicely for obviously the staff theme, part of the Dragon Ball set, introduced in Chapter 3, Season 3. Let's move on to Wrap for this combo now, which is this one right here, which is the Falling Leaf. 
part of the changing season set as well in season chapter 2 season 1 it's an animated web which is pretty cool and goes very nicely with the autumn mantles back bling let's move on to the final and skin combos now for this one i thought i'd use this sushi sign part of the street rep set in season chapter 4 season 2's back pass and the star i'm using is just a sushi sign for the red and the blue goes very nicely with the skin pickaxe is the arrow point carver from this season's battle pass part of the queen of the hunt set in season chapter five season two and this is aphrodite not aphrodite sorry artemis's pickaxe and i'm using the immortal arrow point carver for the orange goes very nicely with the skin you can also use artemis's back bling as well and the actual back bling itself was suggested to me by fn fire one two three thank you very much obviously for this when i was playing some rank for them yesterday said so try this out the skin works very cleanly and move, let's move on to the final weapon up now for the Ang skin, which is this one right here, which is freshly forged, part of the Renegade Flame set, in Houston Chapter 3, Season 4. And it's an animate and reactive weapon up, and it's Blaze's weapon up, using it for like the fiery theme. So that's all the skin combos done for the Ang skin. As I did mention, once I do get the ever version of Ang unlocked, I'll make sure to get combos done for that. And then once I've done that, I'll get all the avatar skins done. I'll be still getting ever battle pass skins done if you ever would have any or ever would like to see any other fortnite related videos for example cosmetic skin back bling pickaxe glider slash umbrella contract weapon or anything other fortnite related always feel free to let me know in the comments down below i'm always down to give something new a go but anyways that was pretty decent